Hey everybody, this is Simon Sage from iMore. We are at GDC 2013 uh, talking with Christian from Moonshot Games about uh, their upcoming title, Third Eye Crime. It is a uh, stealth puzzle game. It's very, it's got a very unique twist. Uh, how's it going, Christian? Ah, uh, pretty good. Yeah, you, you having a good GDC so far? Yeah, it's very busy. Awesome. So t tell, us, tell us a bit about the game here. Okay, so this is uh, Third Eye Crime, where you play Rothko, a telepathic art thief, Ooh. in this sort of stealth puzzle game. Uh, coming out in early June with about 80 to 90 levels. Uh, I'm going to just kick it off here and show you. Oh, here we go. Let's go to the first level here. There we go. Um, and uh, it's set in this very sort of you know deep film noir setting. It's got this great kind of graphic novel quality to it. Uh, also with these uh, very deep jazzy soundtrack. And every so often you get these uh, kind of really nice graphic novel sort of style interstitials. They tell you the whole story of crime, intrigue, the mob, the whole nine yards. Uh, and you're this you know art thief stuck in the middle of it all with uh, power to read minds. <laughs> so. That is a very interesting premise. How, how did you come up with that? What, did you have a particular inspiration, or so basically the game originally originally formed formed around a, a kind of a core AI technique um, called occupancy maps, where we basically wanted to show, uh, as you'll see here in a second, we wanted to show how uh, the NPCs, not just you know not just them moving around, not just them trying to find you, but really what they were doing and, and how they're and how and why they're trying to find you. So as you see here, you know this NPC is chasing me down, but in a second you'll see here something even more interesting, which is that. When the NPCs can't see you, uh, the goons that are trying to chase you down, since you can read their minds, you can get to see where they think you might be. Mm. And you can use that information, so you'll see right here in a second, you can use that information to kind of you know, evade them, sneak around behind them, s steal all sorts of neat, you know, neat loot and whatnot, and uh, make sure you get out safely without getting caught. So you see here, uh, this guy's trying to chase me down, and uh, that blue vision cone, of course, is where he can see me. But when he can't see me, these kind of red glowing areas are the areas that he thinks, that he's right now thinking I might be. Oh. And he's gonna go and keep searching those areas, trying to hunt me down, trying to find me. And of course, since I can read his mind, being a, you know, a telepathic art thief and all, <laughs> I can make sure I'm not there and make sure I don't get caught in uh, kind of fun ways. Very interesting. So, uh, sorry, how many levels did you say there were here? We're gonna we're shooting for about uh, 80 to 90 when it mm -hmm. finally comes out. Um, and so here's another level here again of him trying to hunt me down. Uh, and you know, around in ch about eight chapters or so, and each chapter is gonna tell a whole other you know part of the, part of the story, uh, sort of portion of this uh, saga of uh, crime and intrigue in this you know film noir world. Um, that uh, Rothko is navigating. Uh -huh. So uh, yeah, you're gonna have to get about you know eight or nine. Also these you know those really neat graphic novel interstitials. Also to this beautiful jazz soundtrack. Oh, that's very cool. Okay, so uh, when is this coming out, and how much is it gonna cost? So we're aiming for early June, um, and as for cost, we're not settled on it just yet. Um, still trying to figure that out, but it, sh it shouldn't be too much. Uh, so early June for iPad. Uh, so again, real quick here, you see these guys hunting me down, trying to find me, and I'm gonna make sure I don't get seen by dodging them and staying out of their little red areas. Um, but yeah, so you know, early June, uh, 89 levels and. Price still to be determined with uh, iPhone coming shortly after iPad, and at some point, oh, almost uh, Android, PC, and Mac at some point to follow. Awesome, looking forward to it. Thanks a lot, guys. Thank you very much.